Jones from uh, Go Down Guitars. I'm at GAK.co.uk today just to discuss uh, what we do and how we do it and to look at some, uh, to look at some guitars. Uh, so if you don't know who uh, Seagull or Simon and Patrick are, uh, we're uh, brands that are part of the Godan guitar family. Uh, so uh, Godan are a Canadian and North American uh, guitar company. Robert Godan is the owner of Godan Guitars. Um, and uh, Simon and Patrick and Seagull are uh, just two of our acoustic lines uh, of, uh, of guitars that we do. Um, they're very, very similar. Um, we only use solid timber, uh, so solid tops, um, and we don't do anything with a laminate top. Everything we do is, uh, as I say, made in Canada. Uh, we use a lot of Canadian uh, timber as well. Um, we own the land that uh, a lot of the timber comes from, uh, so that enables us to get uh, to keep our costs low because we don't have to, uh, uh, in most instances, pay for the uh, for the timber from a merchant because we own the land the trees are on. So that helps keep the the cost of the guitar down, which means that you get a, a Canadian-made solid top guitar um, for a lot less than uh, you know uh, it might sort of cost historically to get a guitar from that part of the world. Um, the way that we do things uh, is quite unique. Um, we have quite a few unique building methods. We have, um, for example, pressure tested tops. So all of our tops are uh, guitar tops are tested to make sure that they are the optimum sort of thinness uh, before uh, going too far and actually becoming um, unusable and therefore uh, not going to make a very good guitar top. But because we test them, we can make the top um, just the right right sort of thinness to become incredibly springy and uh, give you really, really good tone. So that's one of the things that we do, which is um, a little bit out there, but it really, really does help the guitars. We also use Adirondack spruce bracing on all of our guitars. Adirondack spruce, if you don't know what that is, it's pretty much the number one uh, spruce to use uh, tonally because it's very, very strong, but it's also incredibly springy. Um, a lot of guitar companies will charge a premium for Adirondack spruce bracing. We put it as a standard on every guitar, regardless of price point. So uh, with that uh, pressure tested top and very thin bracing, which Adirondack spruce allows us to do, um, you have a very resonant guitar. Um, doesn't matter how much you've spent on it, it's, it's going to sound very, 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 very good. Um, all of our guitars ship directly from Canada to the stores. Uh, so there's no uh, warehousing in the UK, so they come straight from Canada into the stores. Um, just very, very briefly, like I touched upon, there's not a massive amount of difference between uh, Simon and Patrick and Seagull, really, other than uh, the sort of shape of the headstock. This is a, um, a Seagull, and the reason why the Seagulls have a thinner headstock is it gives us a nice sort of straighter string pull towards the machine heads, uh, like a strap might give you, so it helps with tuning and other things. Whereas the Simon and Patrick's, which we'll look at, have a squarer headstock, which is for a more uh, kind of traditional customer that might want something a little bit more traditional looking. So uh, the first guitar we're going to look at is this one. Uh, this is a, an S6 Cedar and the, the shape of this is a, a concert hall shape. So it would probably suit somebody that's, that's not necessarily um, a big strummer. Uh, if you do a bit of strumming, a bit of light strumming, but also mainly probably finger pick, this guitar would be perfect for you. Um, the uh, the size of the instrument really does uh, make a difference to uh, how it's going to sound. And so you need to think about when you're buying a guitar, how do I play, what am I going to be using the guitar for? Um, and then that will help you choose the shape with the, with the help from the, from the guys at GAK um, and the Tonewood to, to match your style. Um, cedar also suits finger pickers very well. Uh, it's a very, very soft wood, but um, it's incredibly resonant. So it doesn't take a lot of work to get moving to get going. So again, another example of, of uh, if you're a finger picker, that's why it's a great wood. So let's, uh, let's play it, let's see what it sounds like. 